Good day everyone. Let's try to answer some math problem posted on Facebook. And credits to Master Chidex Hosea for sharing this wonderful question. And I hope I pronounce your name correctly. So let's start. Here's the question. ABCD is a square with a side length of 17 centimeters. Rectangle PQRS is constructed inside the square such that angle SPD is equal to 45 degrees and PR is equal to 13 square root of 2 centimeters. Find the area of PQRS. Now, if you want to try this problem, just pause this video and if you're ready, here's the solution. First thing to notice is we have four isosceles right triangle. So we have PDS, triangle RCS, triangle QDR, and triangle QAP. Those four triangles are isosceles right triangle. Now, let AQ be is equal to X. It follows that AP is also X. Now, recall that the side of this square is equal to 17 centimeters. Since the whole thing is 17 and we have X, BQ is equal to 17 minus X. Also, BR is equal to 17 minus X. Now, using the concept of isosceles right triangle, if the side length is equal to x, the hypotenuse is equal to x multiplied by square root of 2. It follows that this hypotenuse must be 17 minus x multiplied by square root of 2. Now, consider this right triangle. Since we have a right triangle, we can now use Pythagorean theorem. So we have x square root of 2 quantity squared plus 17 minus x square root of 2 quantity squared is equal to 13 square root of 2 squared. Simplify, and we get 2x squared plus 2 multiplied by 289 minus 34x plus x squared is equal to 338. Distribute the 2, and we have 2x squared plus 578 minus 68x plus 2x squared is equal to 338. Combine similar terms, and we get 4x squared minus 68x plus 240 is equal to 0. Divide both sides by 4, and we get x squared minus 17x plus 60 is equal to 0. Now, factor, we have x minus 12 multiplied by x minus 5. Using zero product property, it follows that x minus 12 is equal to 0, or x minus 5 is equal to 0. It follows that x is equal to 12, or x is equal to 5. So, x can be 5 or x can be 12. But with respect to our figure, we choose x is equal to 5. Therefore, x square root of 2 becomes 5 square root of 2. And 17 minus x square root of 2, 17 minus 5 is equal to 12. So, this becomes 12 square root of 2. Now, to find the area of PQRS, this is just the base multiplied by the height. Or simply, 5 square root of 2 multiplied by 12 square root of 2. So we have 5 times 12 is equal to 60 multiplied by 2 and will give us 120 square centimeters. And we're done.